Greninja raids are here. As of just a few hours ago, Greninja is brought to Scarlet and Violet through seven star raids. And honestly, everybody I think was thinking that Greninja raids were going to be the hardest out of the seven stars we've gotten so far. But uh, this guy's kind of a pushover. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be real. The only thing that makes it slightly more difficult, if you can even call it that, is the fact that this guy clicks double team uh, right away. And so you can miss your moves. But otherwise, it's just as easy, if not easier, than all the other raids. So let's go ahead and get into it. So there's probably a few different options that you can use to counter Greninja. Uh, but what I just ended up using was the exact same thing that I used against Cinderace. So if you haven't watched that video, definitely go ahead and check it out, but I'll be going over it again here. So we have Slowbro, obviously level 100 with a Shell Bell. It has Stored Power, Nasty Plot, Iron Defense, and Slack Off. So basically the goal here is to do the exact same thing we did with Cinderace. You send in Slowbro, you click Iron Defense, so you're taking as little damage as possible. You throw in a Slack Off if you need to. You start clicking nasty plot and then you try to kill it as fast as you can with stored power the only difference is greninja likes to wipe your stats away about three or four maybe five turns in usually what i would end up doing would be i would click iron defense twice i would click slack off and then it would wipe my stats away i would start over click iron defense again three times this time click nasty plot three times and then either slack off somewhere in between if I needed it or just use stored power until it died. So with that in mind, let's go ahead and see in action. We go for an iron defense, another iron defense, another iron defense, and now we go for a slack off. Now we go for a nasty plot, another nasty plot, and another nasty plot. And now we just click stored power over and over and over. And we win. So it's really pretty simple. Uh, you only really have to look out for missing stored power because of his double team that he pops in the very beginning. Otherwise, you're pretty much just set to go. Um, so. Just follow this and you should be fine. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and include a, just like the full like real time playthrough of it here. And with that, I will see you guys in the next video. Happy raiding everybody. Good luck getting your Greninjas. I nimbly click Night Slash, but like otherwise it was just like plus two and then I would plus four the turn after that and he would just start spamming with Hydro Bomb. Yeah. Oh, oh my Me. I don't know, I don't know, it slow seems a lot more RNG in the beginning of the turns. Yeah. Oh, I kinda want to record Sire here, just consistently do damage. Quagsire seems pretty decent, a special attack in Quagsire is weird to say, but... <laughs> It does seem pretty decent. I hope that the one she trades you is just always... Dante. Probably not. Could slack off for some protection here from the crit. I mean, I have a crit range. He's not gonna get crit. I didn't get crit all my first time, and then that time I got crit like three times, so... I'll try this, though, chat. I don't know, Silver seems decent here. Silver seems definitely seems decent. I'm just waiting for this cleanse. I'm just setting up until he cleanses. There we go. I missed the restore power, so annoying. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I mean, it's expected. It's definitely expected if the double team, which is why I was opting for an unaware mod. I knew he was gonna have double team. I literally called it. Yeah. As soon as you said it, I was like, "Yo, wait." His setup. I didn't. I didn't think he would have two setup moves though. That is crazy. 
Yeah, it's pretty cool actually. I like it, yeah. We can just so high, like hydro pumps. This is really consistent, yeah. And they were, they were like, yo, it's gonna be cringe. To yeah, true. Yeah, it's a terror to ground. Terror, he would start only using. No, oh, no, no, I'm talking about Slowbro. He'd start only oh. using Hydro Pump, I think. Well, yeah, but Hydro Pump's gonna be doing double damage. It's gonna be doing like 40%, probably. Oh, because you're losing your water typing. Oh, yeah, 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 no, I know, no, no, I know, but like, Storm Power would just be getting, getting yourself back HP. That's true. Dude, speaking of missing sword powers. <laughs> well, yeah, if you then again, yeah, true. If you miss a stored power when you're supposed to recover HP and you just lose, you're not gonna have time to reset up again. That would be awful. Yeah, so bro, maybe he's not as consistent as I thought he was. I think he's definitely still really consistent. I think he's fine. Seems a lot more. Slowbro's about to be yeah. the new Azumarill. <laughs> Seems very RNG though. Yeah. Especially with this double team. Yeah, it's just I missed three already. Oh no, I missed my first star card. Double team again. I haven't hit him yet. I just finished getting set up, so we'll see what happens. Smile. There we go. Boop. Chalk. He all nullifies when I 3 sack defense? Yeah. It, it's early. He nullifies very early. Super, super, super early. Four or five turns into, into the raid. Yeah. There's the cleanse. Okay, cleanses when shield down. I think it's usually yeah, about like 50% of the time. Or, it's yeah. as consistent as I want him to do. It's 50% of the time right here is when he cleanses. Hmm. I can work its way around this. Interesting. Water Observe with the ground? Yeah, or definitely, I don't think Claw Tire is a move. It has Ice Beam. Alright, I'm gonna definitely try the gonna uh, Terra. I'm gonna go for the Terra Psychic Storm Power. I'm trying to come up with a see. method that just doesn't have to deal with... Trying to come up with a method that just doesn't have to deal with you wasting terror shards. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think you might have to. Um, if you really want like optimal consistency. Uh, oh my god. Okay, yeah, terror psychic. Stored power just like one shots it as soon as the shields yeah. are down. He has died. Easy money. Alright, don't throw the Pokeball this time. Uh, I think I've been catching these in Luxury Balls. I'm gonna go for that. Let's chill. Let's go! Astrodrone definitely just get hit, gets hit by... Hmm. Oh, Moonball would have been pretty sick too. Ability patch, TM91, I assume that's gunk shot. A lot of poison terror a lot of poison terror shards, Jesus. Carbos oh, so it it seems a lot more RNG than usual. Yeah. It's like less consistent, but it's still like more consistent than most other options. Mm -hmm.